it was it was scary. We we were tightening our bodies were tightening up and with every wind gust. Samantha Gagney says her family felt safe, but she was up all night in Tampa wondering what the wind would do. They were so strong. I've never heard anything like it before. It was really the noises that kept us up because we were just wondering, did that hit our house? Did that hit our car? The big oak tree ripped out of the ground, but neighbors quickly jumped in to help clear it away. The incredible images of tornadoes dominated fears for many folks. More than 130 tornado warnings were issued. And I think a big part of all of this is just your fears, your worries for the unknown. A friend of Amanda Boucher sent these photos from nearby her Tampa home as she waited out the storm in Orlando. What's normally a 10 minute drive for her friend took an hour. Just avoiding, you know, water log streets and trees down. Um, I think there's definitely some more significant damage the Tampa way um, than there is over here. She says some water got onto her porch, but her windows held up well. I think right now everybody's just taking a big sigh of relief that we made it through. Um, you know, the actual amount of devastation still kind of unknown, um, but Floridians are a bit resilient.